have you have you ever had an instant like that where you you've had to make a you know a, what is essentially a split second decision? And anyone oh who's a parent knows goodness, you make split yes. second decisions all the time. Some of them right. Some Let of them me just wrong. say the words. With three boys. Sw yeah. Four boys. <laughs> four boys. All at once in the swimming pool, and um, something a tiny little thing floats by. And you think, oh my god! It's... Did you recognise? Yes. It? <laughs> I just scooped him up and scooped it, it up. up. <laughs> I just ran for it. it down your bikini top. Which, <laughs> it just goes to the, I thought, well, almost. You, you think that you're, you're, you're prepared for everything when you're, yeah. you're, when you're a mum, particularly of multiples, um, and you can't be prepared for everything. But next time I ever go swimming with babies, I'll take a scoop with me, I think. <laughs> just I, in case. I was on the... I've just gone back from holiday, hence the turn. Anyway. Very nice. Um, on the EasyJet flight, nothing, no, nothing posh, just normal on there with the kids. And Bunny is going through a stage at the moment where she's so naughty, she's into going, don't like you. So anyway, Kieran was oh, sitting there. Behind sweet. Kieran, there was um, a man and she wanted her toys or something because she didn't want to stay in her seatbelt. So she kept looking at the man going, don't like you, like that. <laughs> so he must have thought, oh, my God, you're such a bad parent, you can't control her. So it's like, well, actually, I've got other kids. Let me show you how angelic this one is. It's like I wanted to get Jet and put him in front and say, see, look how well behaved this one is. Look at how he's sitting there. This but, one's really good. Like, I had to just, like, you feel like you have to justify. Oh, gosh, yeah. Um, well, they were even though I wanted mortified. to kill her at the time. Because there's always somebody who'll disapprove. Oh, gosh. Why? I know. That's so unfair. But with kids, like, like, on an aeroplane, it is boring for them to sit there for seat, but they do need yeah. to cater a bit more for kids. When... And also, changing nappies on a plane is useless. And I have changed a nappy on the seat next to me with a baby as well. Just thought I'd put that in. No. Well, but, yeah. yeah. You've Sometimes that. you've just got to. You just... Yes. Yeah. Now, Liz, we did, a, we did a poll on this, and basically we asked, is it ever OK to change a nappy in a restaurant? Um, is it ever OK to change a nappy in a restaurant? 81% um, said no. Oh, come on, audience. Oh. Be kinder. I said no 19% said yes, 81 said no. It depends on the circumstances. Where you are in the restaurant. What? Yeah, exactly. and that's, Very in, strong. that's <laughs> inside a restaurant as well. Oh, she said it wasn't explained. Oh, it wasn't explained properly. Now you understand because she was out on the grass and she was yeah. like... Oh, yeah. yeah, so that's all right. <laughs> oh, gosh, I've had Finley run down the, um, the, the aisle of an aeroplane, <laughs> poo trailing down his leg. No. Um, <laughs> he was 14 at the time. <laughs> <laughs> I love you for that. <laughs> 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 